Hey there, tech enthusiasts. Are you tired of lugging around heavy laptops that weigh you down? You dream of a compact computing solution that fits in your pocket. Well, you're in for a treat today. We're diving into the world of mini pocket laptops, those tiny powerhouses that pack a punch without breaking your back. Whether you're a digital nomad, a student on the go, or just someone who values portability, these little machines might just be the answer to your prayers. So, are you ready to discover the best mini pocket laptops on the market? Let's get started. Kicking off our list at number 7 is the Apple 2020 MacBook Air with the revolutionary M1 chip. Now, I know what you're thinking, wait, isn't this a full-sized laptop? Well, you're not wrong, but hear me out. This MacBook Air is so thin and light that it almost feels like a mini laptop when you're carrying it around. I've been using this MacBook Air for a few months now, and I'm continually amazed by its performance. The M1 chip is a game-changer, offering incredible speed and efficiency. Apps open in a blink, and even demanding tasks like video editing are smooth as butter. The 13.3-inch Retina display is a visual treat, making everything from documents to movies look crisp and vibrant. One of the standout features of this MacBook Air is its battery life. I've managed to squeeze out up to 18 hours of use on a single charge, which is nothing short of impressive. It's perfect for those long days when you're hopping from coffee shop to coffee shop, working on the go. The Magic Keyboard is a joy to type on, with just the right amount of key travel. And let's not forget about the massive trackpad, it's responsive and supports all those handy macOS gestures that make navigation a breeze. While it might be pushing the boundaries of what we consider a mini laptop, the MacBook Air's portability and power make it a worthy contender in this list. It's a fantastic option for those who want a compact machine without compromising on performance or the macOS experience. Coming in at number 6, we have the GPD Micro PC, a true pocket-sized powerhouse. This little beast packs a 6-inch screen into a form factor that's not much bigger than a large smartphone. When I first got my hands on this device, I was skeptical about its usability, but it quickly won me over. The GPD Micro PC runs on Windows 10 Pro, giving you access to all your favorite desktop applications in a tiny package. It's powered by an Intel Celeron N4100 processor, which, while not a speed demon, is more than capable of handling everyday tasks like web browsing, document editing, and even light coding. One of the most impressive features of the GPD Micro PC is its port selection. Despite its diminutive size, it manages to squeeze in a full-size HDMI port, three USB 3.0 ports, and even an RS-232 serial port a feature that's particularly useful for IT professionals and network administrators. The keyboard, while compact, is surprisingly usable once you get used to it. I found myself able to type at a decent speed after a few days of practice. The track point in the center of the keyboard is responsive and accurate, making navigation easy even without a mouse. Battery life is solid, with the device lasting around 6 to 8 hours on a single charge in my testing. This makes it a great option for field work or for those who need a capable Windows machine that can literally fit in their pocket. 5. At the midpoint of our list, we have the Microsoft Surface Go 3. This 10.5-inch laptop hybrid offers the versatility of Windows 11 in a compact, lightweight package. After spending some time with this device, I can confidently say it's a solid choice for those who want the functionality of a full Windows PC in a more portable form factor. The Surface Go 3 features a bright, crisp 10.5-inch PixelSense display with a resolution of 1920 by 1280 The touchscreen is responsive and works great with the optional Surface Pen, making it ideal for note-taking or digital art. The built-in kickstand is sturdy and allows for multiple viewing angles, which I found particularly useful when using the device in different settings. Under the hood, the Surface Go 3 is powered by an Intel Pentium Gold or Core i3 processor, depending on the configuration. In my testing, I found the Core i3 version to be snappy enough for everyday tasks like web browsing, document editing, and even some light photo editing. However, it's worth noting that this isn't a device for heavy multitasking or resource-intensive applications. One of the standout features of the Surface Go 3 is its versatility. With the optional type cover attached, it transforms from a tablet into a mini laptop. The type cover offers a surprisingly good typing experience given its size, and the trackpad, while small, is accurate and responsive. 
Battery life is decent, lasting around 8 to 9 hours in my real world usage. This makes it a great companion for a full day of work or study. The compact charger is also a plus, adding minimal bulk to your bag. 4. Just missing out on the top 3, we have another offering from Apple. The 2020 MacBook Pro with the M1 chip. Like its air sibling, this isn't strictly a mini laptop, but its power to size ratio is so impressive that it deserves a spot on this list. The 13-inch MacBook Pro M1 is a powerhouse in a compact package. In my time using this machine, I've been consistently blown away by its performance. The M1 chip handles everything from basic productivity tasks to demanding video editing with ease. Apps open instantly, and even complex operations like rendering 4K video are surprisingly quick. One of the standout features of this MacBook Pro is its stunning retina display. The colors are vibrant, the blacks are deep, and the 500 nits of brightness make it usable even in bright outdoor settings. Whether you're editing photos, watching movies, or just browsing the web, everything looks fantastic on this screen. The keyboard on this MacBook Pro is excellent. The keys have good travel and feel responsive, making long typing sessions a pleasure. The touch bar, while divisive among some users, can be quite useful once you get used to it, offering context-sensitive controls for various applications. Battery life is another area where this MacBook Pro shines. In my testing, I've regularly gotten 15 to 17 hours of use on a single charge, which is incredible for a laptop this powerful. This means you can leave your charger at home and work all day without worrying about running out of juice. While it might be stretching the definition of a mini laptop, the MacBook Pro M1S combination of power, portability, and battery life make it a compelling option for those who need serious performance in a relatively compact package. Breaking into our top three, we have the Dell XPS 13 9310. This laptop might be pushing the boundaries of what we consider mini, but its nearly borderless infinity edge display allows it to pack a 13.4-inch screen into a chassis that's closer in size to many 11-inch laptops. The first thing you'll notice about the XPS 13 is its stunning design. The aluminium chassis feels premium and robust, while the carbon fiber palm rest is both comfortable and stylish but it's the display that really steals the show. The 16-10 aspect ratio gives you more vertical space compared to traditional 16-9 screens, which I found incredibly useful for productivity tasks. Performance-wise, the XPS 13 is a powerhouse. The model I tested came with an 11th gen Intel Core i7 processor and 16 GB of RAM, and it handled everything I threw at it with ease. From heavy multitasking with dozens of browser tabs open to editing high-resolution photos in Lightroom, the XPS 13 never skipped a beat. The keyboard on the XPS 13 is one of the best I've used on a laptop this size. The keys have good travel and feel responsive, making long typing sessions comfortable. The glass trackpad is large and accurate, supporting all of Windows multi-touch gestures. Battery life is impressive, lasting around 11 to 12 hours in my real-world usage. This means you can easily get through a full workday on a single charge. The compact charger is also a plus, adding minimal bulk to your bag when you do need to carry it. 2. Just missing out on the top spot, we have the Asus VivoBook L210. This 11.6-inch laptop is a testament to how much functionality can be packed into a truly compact form factor. After spending some time with this little machine, I can say it's an excellent choice for students or anyone looking for a highly portable Windows laptop on a budget. The VivoBook L210 weighs just 2.31 pounds and is only 0.67 inches thick, making it incredibly easy to slip into a backpack or even a large purse. Despite its small size, it doesn't feel cramped to use. The 11.6-inch HD display while not the sharpest out there, is perfectly adequate for everyday tasks like web browsing, document editing, and watching videos. Under the hood, the L210 is powered by an Intel Celeron N4020 processor and 4GB of RAM. While these specs won't win any awards for speed, I found them sufficient for basic multitasking and everyday productivity work. The 64GB NK storage is on the small side, but the inclusion of a Micros card slot allows for easy expansion. One of the standout features of the L210 is its keyboard. Despite the laptop's compact size, Asus has managed to fit in a full-sized keyboard with good key travel. I was surprised at how comfortable it was to type on for extended periods. 
The trackpad is also responsive and supports Windows Precision drivers for accurate multi-touch gestures. Battery life is another strong point for the L210. In my testing, I consistently got around 10 to 12 hours of use on a single charge, which is excellent for a laptop in this price range. This makes it a great option for students who need to get through a full day of classes without worrying about finding a power outlet. Taking the crown as our top mini pocket laptop is the IQ 10.1 inch laptop mini notebook. This little powerhouse proves that good things really do come in small packages. After extensive testing, I can confidently say that this laptop offers the perfect balance of portability, functionality, and affordability. The first thing that struck me about the IQ Mini Notebook was its incredibly compact size. With a 10.1-inch display, it's small enough to fit comfortably in a large pocket or a small bag, yet large enough to work on comfortably. The build quality is surprisingly good for its price point, with a sturdy plastic chassis that feels like it can withstand the rigors of daily use. Despite its small size, the IQ doesn't skimp on connectivity. It comes equipped with two USB ports, a mini HDMI port, and a Micros card slot, giving you plenty of options for expanding its capabilities. The inclusion of both Wi-Fi and Bluetooth ensures you can stay connected wherever you go. The 10.1-inch IPS display is a joy to use. While it's not the highest resolution out there, the colors are vibrant and the viewing angles are excellent. I found it perfectly suitable for everything from document editing to watching YouTube videos. The touchscreen functionality is responsive and adds an extra layer of convenience, especially when navigating Windows 10. Speaking of Windows 10, that's another big plus for this little laptop. Unlike some mini laptops that run on mobile operating systems, the iQ gives you the full Windows experience. This means you can run all your favorite desktop applications, making it a true productivity powerhouse. Performance-wise, the iQ is powered by an Intel Atom Z8350 processor and 4GB of RAM. While it won't win any speed records, I found it more than capable of handling everyday tasks like web browsing, document editing, and even some light photo editing. The 64GB of onboard storage isn't huge, but it's easily expandable thanks to the Microsoft card slot. The keyboard, while compact, is surprisingly usable. After a short adjustment period, I found myself able to type at nearly my normal speed. The trackpad is responsive and supports multi-touch gestures, making navigation a breeze. Battery life is another area where the IQ shines. In my testing, I consistently got around 6 to 8 hours of use on a single charge, which is impressive for a laptop this small. This makes it perfect for students, travelers, or anyone who needs a capable computer that can last all day. And there you have it, folks our rundown of the best mini pocket laptops on the market. From full-fledged Windows machines to powerful MacBooks, there's something here for everyone. Whether you're a student, a professional on the go, or just someone who values portability, these compact computers prove that good things really do come in small packages. So, which one caught your eye? Are you ready to downsize your laptop without downsizing your productivity? Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech reviews and comparisons. Until next time, stay tech savvy.